Now, we've seen Nat's on-court action. Let's see how she goes with the microphone, doing a live cross for us. So we're just going to pretend that we're actually doing this for the television. It is a live cross. Um, and we will be joining our reporter on the spot, Natalie Medhurst, who has with her three of the four players that made their Australian Diamonds debut in 2015, Gabby Simpson, Gretel Tippett and Joe Weston. So let's hear from Natalie Medhurst now. Hi, thank you, Nick. You actually sound like my mother calling me Natalie. I'm but, sorry. Um, no, that's un all good. So, yeah, here with the three girls who made their debut this year. First one off the rank, Gabby Simpson, making her debut in Christchurch. Now, we've had a little bit of a discussion about this. You are known to not be the tidiest athlete going around. So, how did you find your dress before that game? Do you know what? Um, I think it was at the bottom of my bag, maybe under a few different layers of clothes, or on the floor. Actually, C Bass was my roomie at the time, so she had to help me look. <laughs> and your dress actually did go missing for a few moments because we have a tradition where our netball dresses get handed to us by a past player. Um, and so tell us about a little bit what that was like for you. That was amazing. I cried. Classic me. I cried everything though. But yeah, it was a very nice time. Rosalie actually presented the dress to me and that was really nice because she's obviously been my ANZ coach for the last three years. So very special moment for me. Lovely. And an outstanding debut by Gabby. Now, next one on the end, lovely in white. Uh, Gretchen, I mean Gretel. Um, uh, no, so tell us a little bit, Gretchen, please explain. Um, I don't know Gretchen, to be honest, so Kimberly um, made that up and I don't think anyone needs to know her, so... <laughs> I, I, for people of you, she's playing a bit coy, so Gretchen is her um, alter ego, so she's known to probably have a few different personalities, but so when you made your debut out at Wing Attack, did Gretchen have to come out and really help you get through that in a completely different position? Yeah, a little bit. I think she came out at the start and then I got a bit more comfortable, so Gretel came out again. But <laughs> um, <laughs> when, when I get angry, I turn into Gretchen, so <laughs> Kayla saw Gretchen a lot, a lot of the time. Nice. Well, hopefully we don't see too much of her tonight. Boys, look out. She is on the prowl. <laughs> um, next one, we have the very lovely, also single. Um, she did not want me to mention that, but however, yes, we are a dating service. Um, we have Joe Weston here. Joe, playing your debut on your home turf in Melbourne, what was that like? Um, pretty amazing. It was just surreal. <laughs> Could not sound, no, honestly. Um, <laughs> I was going to say could sound more sarcastic. <laughs> no, um, and, you know, for you to wear the green and gold, it was obviously a very late call-up into the team, probably a little bit out of the blue for you. So to be there in the green and gold, has it always, you know, did it live up to all those expectations? Yeah, it was disappointing to lose, but uh, it was a phenomenal experience and it was amazing to, I guess, take part of it. Um, with people I've watched growing up and yeah, it was just amazing. <laughs> Perfect. Now, um, we've actually started a tradition. Um, I'm very proud to say I was a part of this along with my fellow shooter, Caitlin Bassett, in that we have now created these lovely pendants for all the players who have made their debut and it backdates to all the past players as well, which um, is, I think, extremely special. It has our test cap number on it um, and obviously the Southern Cross as well. So I would love to present these to you, to Gabby, number 164. I will say Gretel, Gretel 165. And last but not least, to our most recent debutante, Joe Weston, 167. Thank you so much, and back to you, Nick.